everyone and welcome back to another episode of Jurassic World Alive! Like the next day is it? Something like that. I didn't expect to be making a video this soon. There's been a whole update and new dinosaurs have been added. Although you can't really get any of them just yet. But guys, I managed to get one. Oh, and it's a pretty good one. I mean, you've probably already seen the thumbnail tell, right? Yeah, I think so. Anyway, so we'll not waste any more time and we'll talk about the update. So I've got it on my phone here. Um, so there's a Tyrant Pass now. The first time in-game uh, pass that will allow you to earn exclusive rewards such as valuable items and exclusive skins, which we are going to take a look at because some of them are pretty cool. Uh, learn more about this upcoming exciting future here at Ludi, and then they, they link the thing. So we're, we're definitely going to go over it. Um, but they've changed where daily rewards are because if you normally, you'd click on this and it would take you to daily rewards and alliance rewards. It's moved. So, this is the new... Actually, I don't even know what this is. Um, so, this is where you get your dailies. And, I mean, there you go. I don't know what that exactly does. But I assume it goes towards something. <laughs> you would have thought. Um, so, yeah, we, hopefully we've got a better audio system than last time. I've, I've got, like, soundproofing. Except for I haven't stuck it up yet. So, if we can talk like this. We're, it's actually really nice. But we don't do that. So, between June 1st to... July 6th, complete missions to rank up your battle pass for exclusive rewards when you reach the final levels. You can achieve unique DNA and exclusive Thordorosaurus skin. Check out what other rewards are available to claim in-game once the pass is active. So, I, it should be starting to be active now. I don't think I've got access to it at the moment. I'm really not too sure. Also, uh, thank you for all the support in the last video. I feel, I feel like I always start these videos with Jurassic World Live on a positive note. It's like, oh, this game's really good. And then I do a few battles and um, yeah, I, I'm reminded of why I don't really like it too much. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, anyway. Um, so hopefully it will be a happier one this time because we've got loads of cool things. Uh, I will just quickly dart some of the dinosaurs before we get into the skins and the updates and the new dinosaurs because I'm super excited. Um, and I'm also going to chuck it in a sanctuary once I've leveled it up because I want to sort of share that with everybody. Uh, the reason as to how I actually managed to unlock... Um, the dinosaurs we're about to see. Oh, I just said the Giga. We've got the Giga. Okay, we've got the, yeah, the, the hashtag, the MLG Pro million subscribers. Thank you. <laughs> I've already got that. Oh, five million subscribers. Thank you. <laughs> um, was because I finally I caved because there was an incubator that gave you 200 T-Rex DNA. And I went, you know what? Sod it. I'll just buy it. I don't care. This is my job. <laughs> I've got to put aside, you know, what is reasonable to an extent. And just showcase stuff. And because I don't get any special treatment, which I'm kind of happy for, um, you know, th it's the way it is. Uh, so there was like an incubator in here. I don't know which one it was. It gave you T-Rex DNA, like Rexy DNA. However, it also gave you like uh, a chance to get epic DNA as well. And through that, we managed to get, I don't know how I did it. It was just like, well, it was complete chance. We had the freaking Giga. Here it is, the Giga from Dominion. Uh, do we actually have Giga in the game? I don't think we do. Um, so that's interesting. So they must have planned ahead because Jurassic World Evolution came out, I think around about the same time, but they have a Giga in And here it is, Gigantosaurus, which actually has the Gigang, Giginx, the Giginx as its hybrid. So, oh, I'm so excited. So let's go, let's go. Create the Gigantosaurus. So good! It looks so good. But is it good? A 30% chance of a crit is pretty decent. Uh, we can level it up possibly twice. So we'll level it up to, I think, 13. If it's, yeah, it's 150. Yes, look at this! this the, I didn't, like, I didn't even, like, think I was going to make a video on this. I've already got videos ready for today. But, uh, heck yeah, we're going to do that. So there we are. Gigantosaurus. Um, so it's got Fierce Devouring Cleanse, which is one of these that it gets healed back. Uh, 180 on it when it does that damage. Alert Showdown. So, um, threatened. HP, 9411. Unable to swap for two turns. Heal 100% of max HP. Target highest damage. Unable to swap the two turns. 100% chance of stun. <gasps> Ooh. So if I remember right, um, if you swap in... That's what this means. So the red icon, which is the critical obstruction, means if an enemy swaps out. And the other one means if you swap in, I think. 
Somebody told me, it was like, well, when will Diva realize this? <laughs> Look, okay, I'm stupid. <laughs> you don't watch this for MLG plays. Um, so if you're threatened, if you're below half, you can swap in. 100% uh, chance to stun them for one turn if they're not immune to it. Get your full health back. That's that's pretty amazing. That means that this Gigantrix or whatever it is, is going to be almost now on Unstoppable if it has that as well as all of this, like, go through shield, go through um, armor, and possibly heal yourself. It's immune to a speed reduction. Uh, yeah, I mean, I mean, it's, it's, an, it's an epic, right? It's not going to be the best thing in the world, let's be honest. However, this looks freaking good. <laughs> we cannot deny that. Um... Wow, that looks awesome. Okay, let's tap it. Yum, 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 yum. Does it have its cleft lip? It does have its cleft lip. Now, is it also on the other side? It isn't. That's interesting. So they paid extra attention when modeling this. Is there another one? There's the raw. It's a shame that it doesn't have the Giga raw. Just like Rexy doesn't have Rexy's raw. Maybe they'll patch that in. That would be quite cool. Um, so, with that being said, I am now just going to place it in an incubator. Oh, level so we'll just, we'll just plonk it in here and then interact with it and see what it can do. So, I think it's like, it's not 15. I think it's below, so we're going to have to scroll a little bit. There it is. We'll plonk it in. Boom! Giga popped in. Right, let's have a look. Let's go for the play interact interaction. Oh, okay, well, sorry. My bad. I think it'll probably be exactly the same as the T-Rexes. Very rarely do they actually switch it. So let's do the play one. Oh, he's the tie. So yeah, I think it's exactly the same as the T-Rex. Which is a bit of a shame. Because Gig is like, you know, the big baddie. It's it's like an Indoraptor. It's like an Indominus Rex. But it has the T-Rex animation. Let's see what it, Maybe it feeds different. No, it feeds the same as a T-Rex. Okay, cool. But look at that. That looks awesome. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm excited. I'm excited. I can't believe I got this. That's sweet. Right, well, there you go. I'll, uh, I'll just... <laughs> two seconds. I'll let my alliance know it's in there now. Right, but that is not the only thing that I wanted to do. No, no, no. We've seen the Giga. Um, but there's so much other... Th or so many other things, I should say. Real English, James. No, we're in Japan. But we can't forget how to speak proper. Because uh, <laughs> so we'll go to Modern Rex. And as you see in the bottom left... We actually have a coat hanger icon. And if you click on this, you can switch Mortem Rex to its alternate skin. Look at that. So it's like an albino. Look at the eyes. They're like silver. This thing looks so friggin' cool. And I'm assuming you're gonna need to pay for it. It's gonna be one of these things. I, I don't think I even am able to do it. It's probably in a menu. I don't think they've really explained it very well. So there's a couple of dinosaurs that have skins. That Morton Rex looks awesome. I mean, and I love that they're doing this. It's not a, it's not like Hungry Shark Evolution or World where a skin will give you, um, you know, uh, some sort of perk, maybe extra health or damage. Maybe that'll come down the line, but th that wouldn't surprise me because then it'll be like, oh, it's a Thordor and it's got the plus attack. Oh, brilliant. <laughs> so Thordor has the Conquest skin. Um, not, it's, it's all right. It's... I think out of all of, I mean, out of this one and the default skin, I think I prefer the default skin. Um, the, the, just the green looks way nicer and the blue. I know it's like, oh, it's something different, but even for me, I think I prefer that one. So yeah, I think this guy has a skin, if I remember right. Yes, it does. It has the Besieger skin. So really not too much of a difference. It's probably gonna, if anything, it's, it'll be a free skin, right? Because Tristornix isn't really used when it comes to the meta. I think it, it was probably used in like the, the skill tournaments or something like that. So I will quickly have a look now and just, oh, hold on. There it is. Skins. I was going to say, that's how we can just easily see the skins. And the other one is a Citadel skin, which is for the dinosaur that we actually don't have any of at the moment. So if we scroll down, we'll have a look and see what is new, what new things have came out. I mean, obviously there's like some dinosaurs here that I don't have. So this hybrid is the Lystrosaurus, I think it is. That's the little thing that we'll see in Dominion that's in like the illegal fighting ring or something like that. So of course we don't have that, but look at them, they're so cute. <laughs> they're like little Ceratopsis, little babas. And of course we've got this thing, which is gonna take a level 20 giga. And I'm assuming this is gonna be 
pretty killer. Not only does Tristornix have a skin, but also this thing has a skin. Uh, there's also been some changes. There's not too many differences in nerfs and buffs with this update. I think Thordor has had an update, some other dinosaurs, but it's it's kind of the top ones. So Thordor and some other uniques and possibly Apex. I think... Um, some Apex have had an update. I don't really care too much, to be fair. Like I said, I ain't MLG. But, you know, if it changes and it's good for me, I love it. <laughs> but one thing I wanted to do was find Rexy. Because I have a lot of DNA now for Rexy. And I feel like if I'm going to have a T-Rex on my team, and I have a level 30 T-Rex, even though it's terrible. Really, it's, it's interesting to me that we have, you know, Rexy in the game when we've had T-Rex for so long. And it, I, it just makes you wonder, did they always have the plan for Rexy? And if it, if it wasn't the case, did they have the actual files, like ILM files? Because this T-Rex looks really accurate to, you know, the one you see on screen. Even looking at it, like, front on, if it stands still, look at that! That is an amazing sculpt. I think the, the nose is a little bit too blunt, possibly. It needs to be, like, extended a tiny bit more. But... Oh, I like seeing this thing. Oh, oh, it's so good. It's It looks so beautiful. We've got the Giga. We've got Rexy. I kind of want... I wanted Giga to be, you know, a legendary or, you know, something like that. We can get this thing to level 20, I think, without really any consequence to anything else, I would say, anyway. Because once you get level 20, that's probably what you need if you want to hybridize it with something else. And already at level 20, you've got... Yeah, well, actually, it's not that great. <laughs> I can't lie. I can't lie. But I really want to use this guy. I want to use this in the high up leagues. So what do I have for boosts? I'm, I need to have a think about what to do. Because it's 100, right? So I could boost its speed by 9. We go for the dominant roar. And then we go for fierce devouring rampage. You've got, what, an extra 50 damage increase, and then your speed is increased. You don't even decrease your speed, so you will always be faster. Um, unless Nullify. Yeah, Nullify could work, I guess, on the Hydra Bow or something like that. But it looks so good! And also, when they escape, you do an attack to them. And when you swap in, you slow them, 100%. It's just... It's so good. I kind of just want to. I kind of just want to. Should we do it? Should we put nine? Oh, wait. Ooh, we can only put 20 boosts on it so far. So I kind of just want to increase its speed a little bit. So if we get it to like 20, and then we increase it by like 25%. What's that? Like 24 on top takes it to like 440 odd. I feel like we need, we need to at least go for the nine. Yeah, there we go. We're going to 124. And let's say we max that out to 20. That leaves us with 10 for the attack. So we may as well just go for, you know, a, a, quite a bit of attack. We'll just put all the attack on it. Maybe? Am I wasting boosts here? Probably. But do I care? In future, I will. But right now, no. <laughs> so we'll go for all that. Look at that. Yes. At level 20. Is there going to be a way to actually get Rex DNA? Who knows? Maybe it's just a complete pay-to-win creature. Wouldn't that surprise you? But I'm going to put this on my team now. It's... <laughs> I don't even know what to swap out for it, if I'm going to be honest. Hopefully it gets a skin as well. Um, who do I not need uh, as much? You know what? The, the the snake is like fully boosted. But for the lulls, we'll swap that out. Because I don't think it's the best, if I'm going to be honest. And we'll put Rexy in. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Level 20 Rexy. Let's go. Okay. I just realized we probably could have used the Giga in... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> in something. Uh, but I think now, because I've actually put it in an incubator... <laughs> no! It's in the sanctuary, dammit! <laughs> we could have just used it in the battle. But hey-ho! What we'll do is we'll have some fun, and we'll use Rexy in an actual, like, I don't know, what is it, Gyrosphere League? If we can get it. Fingers crossed. Okay, here we go. Do we get the friggin' thing? Do we get Rexy? Please give me Rexy. Please give me Rexy. No! Okay, M will we keep this in? We'll see, we'll see. Does it does it make much of a difference? I don't know, we'll find out. We'll just do a regular battle. If I win, I'll keep it in. If I lose, I don't. Did I win? Good. <laughs> right. Ooh, he's actually faster, but has like 500 less health. So yeah, okay, it has one extra speed boost, but then uh, it actually has attack increase. That is interesting for an Indotaurus. 
Huh. Oh, is it? Did he disconnect? It looks like he disconnected. Oh, oh, okay. Well, that's good. Didn't go through that. And uh, that's gonna be... Oh, and a crit. Oh, no. Oh, oh, okay. So, what? Has, has perfect connection now, but there might be... Oh, oh, it just survived. Oh, it just survived. So, he's pretty much dead if I had something that swapped in and did damage. Um, however, I don't. <laughs> so, uh, I don't know what to do here. Um, do I, f I think I just fought off my end of Taurus. That is a shame. That is a damn shame. Um, we were so close. We got so lucky. But in the end, it didn't even matter. Uh, so, thinking about this, do we go for... I think... Mm, Hmm. I think if we... We could get a speed boost off on our uh, Gorgosaurus or whatever it's called. What is this called? G -g 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 Gorgotrabex, that's it. At least we can get some speed. Um, and I think... Does the cloak... Cloak might not last. Oh, interesting. So he gets his evasiveness. It doesn't get a speed boost. And I think we're at 10% quicker, so we might even outspeed him. What would have been really good if I just went for my big hit? That would have been brilliant. Um, do we outspeed it? Uh, no, we don't. Damn. Okay. But, I mean, he can't really do much. I mean, you could have at least done some damage, I suppose. <laughs> It's just in the in the mindset of, like, that's what you do with it. You put him in, you get long invincibility, it's all golden. Um, okay. Okay. Also, in my last video, people were like, Beavis, you should have just done this, and then you would have won. <sighs> you think I'm, I think I'm clever? <laughs> uh, so... He's probably going to go for his instant thing here, isn't he? So I may as well. Oh, he doesn't! Oh, that is interesting. I so thought he would. Um, now how quick is it? Oh, yeah, there's no way I'm outspeeding this. Oh, 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 this is interesting. Because what I could do here is... Because I know he's going to go for that. Um, yeah, look at this plate. This is... I don't... Oh, thank God I resisted it. I was going to say, if I didn't resist that... Oh, dear. <laughs> what is my resistance to? Said, okay, so it was a good chance. So he didn't do too much damage to me. We swap in ref. And then we reduce his uh, attack even more. So he does nothing. He's probably wasted his instant... Bam! That's how you do it. <laughs> MLG plays. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. And now, what can he do is sidestep. It doesn't matter if he goes for sidestep because this thing goes through, um... What's it called? Goes through... <laughs> no, no. <laughs> Cloak. <laughs> That's it. That's the one. Oh, I think he's given up. Was that was that a give... Oh, and the crit. What was the chance of that? 20%. Oh. Oh, dear. I want a Rexy belt. I want, and if I can win with like using using Rexy, that'd be hilarious. I don't think I can. It needs really Rexy needs to be higher than level twenty and have more speed boosts. But I don't have that. Actually, well, I've got the books now. I suppose the next time a thing comes up, I can just be like, books off you go. <laughs> oh, I think he's he's either yeah he's given up. I think he's just rage quit. He's like, screw you. <laughs> I like his icon is the um. The Tani Calagrius uh, hybrid or whatever it is. So, uh, oh, I'm excited. I, I want to use the Rexy. It's a shame that we didn't see Giga, like, in battle. But at least we've got it. Next time, I, whenever the Sanctuary ends, actually, we'll have a look. Oh, that was a clean 5,000. Well, nice. Um, yeah, we'll have a look at when the Sanctuary expires. And then we'll make a video, do some battles with Giga. Just have some fun. Yeah. Oh, nice. <laughs> Come on, this is the one. I feel it. I can see Rexy. It's red. It's right there. I'm visualizing. Yes! <sighs> what, do we open with it? <laughs> I, do, do we? I, I want to try and win with it. That's the thing. I want to try and win with it. So we'll do it. Uh, maybe well, Scorpius Rex is probably the safest opener out of that. None of them are really that safe. Oh, that would have been cool, though. A Trichosaur against a uh, freaking T-Rex would have been awesome. But you know what? This is a way better matchup. Yeah, that's... You. I very rarely see freaking Trichos this high up. That's... That's very interesting. Very weird. <laughs> oh, okay. I mean, I would like to use the T-Rex. 
don't just die, please. Don't, don't just, don't just give this to me, please. <laughs> or at least, you know, do something. Yes. There we go. That's more like it. Yes. I'll happily take on one of these. You know what we'll do? Yes, he's went for priority as well first. Brilliant. Okay, so when we die next turn, because we will die next turn, uh, we'll bring in Rexy and Rexy will just kill it. Just go for the superiority, like the priority thing. That's what we'll do. Because I don't think we're going to kill this here. Yeah, I'd be. If we're going to crit, maybe? No, definitely not. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe this isn't the best idea. Does it have two cooldown? Right, it's a three cooldown. Okay, okay. It could be worse. Could be worse. We'll do our instant distraction. I think that's probably the safest bet. Because he, he could go for nullifying, actually. But he is faster, so we definitely didn't do that. Oh, he went... Oh, okay. Okay, no, I... Yeah, I think he's killed me here. Um, oh, he didn't! That's that's amazing. That's very impressive. Um, so, I mean, does it bleed? Do you bleed? You do. Uh, so, I may, I'm just going to go for that. Oh, he goes for a swap. In Ooh, I think it's killed me. Yeah, I think this has killed me. Interesting. Very interesting. Uh, it did go through. I think it would have killed me either way. Oh, he's max up Model of Rhino. This is like an old school team. I like it. So I could do... What's my revenge? Is that that one? I, I want to do that. What's its speed? Heck yeah. Let's bring in T-Rex. Yes. <laughs> he's like, what? Right, okay. We'll go party. Then we'll do the, the, the thing that means we heal some damage. I don't really care. I'm just, I just want to use it just once. Against a mono rhino. Look at that damage. I hurt it. Yes. <laughs> He's like, what? No, not a cunning. No. Oh my god. No, no, no. no. Well, at least I got to do this. But that's all I want to do. I want to do this and then a big hit. We're level 20. It's 10 levels higher. It's got max attack. Oh, okay. Oh, there it is. So there's some damage. I think we're we're not going to heal enough to... Oh, we didn't heal anything. Oh, do we have to survive? Uh... <laughs> we have to survive. That's a little bit of a difference there. Yes, I can see that being a little bit of a problem. Okay, so we may have lost this one because we basically just wasted a dinosaur. But at least we got to see it. And it did over half damage to something. Maybe I could have went for my revenge afterwards and done more damage. But, uh, oh, you know, the actual crushing blow and not that one. I'm not too sure if that would have done more damage. But hey-ho, he's got, yeah, no, a referentum that is gonna go for the superiority. I mean, do, I mean, what's it speed? 132. I mean, yeah, it's gonna go first. It's gonna do the super distraction. It doesn't get its crit off. It does an all right amount of damage. We do resist the bleed. Um, Mon Rhino is probably going to come in next turn and kill me. I think I had 2,200 or was it 2,700? Oh, nope, doesn't matter. We won anyway. That's brilliant. I forgot about we don't take any distraction. Wow, okay, we won with Rexy on our team. It didn't do much, but we still won. <laughs> That's the important thing. So, guys, we're going to wrap it up here. Um, we'll probably make another episode in like two days' time when we get Giga back. And we'll just do some regular fights with her. We'll just have some fun with her. We'll see. If they unlock anything new, that would be cool too. I don't know. This game's pay to win. So, hey, if I can boost my T-Rex with real money, why not? <laughs> so, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like. And until next time, I'll see you cuties later. Oh, bye-bye.